Good evening, ECS School Board. My name is Leah Johnston, and I am your Visual and Performing Arts student representative. Arts education in Eureka City Schools continues to move ahead. This time of year is traditionally a busy time for our performing arts students, so we would like to take this time to share with you many of the activities that would normally occur during December. Limited Edition is usually very busy with many community performances, including singing for service clubs, private parties, and general caroling around town. This wonderful ensemble would have had between 20 and 35 performances in December. Our high school band and orchestra students would normally be polishing the music for our evening performances as well as the Red and Green Assembly on the last day of school in December. We know everyone will miss the EHS rendition of Sleigh Ride and, of course, Carol of the Bells. Middle school music performances are traditionally in January, so December is the time when they are finalizing music selections and preparing. One thing that is the same as other years is the ordering and distribution of Winship sweatshirts. In the past, they've had shirts that just say Winship Music. But this year, in an attempt to bring everyone closer, they now have ensemble-specific sweatshirts to show their Viking pride. They would not have done this alone, and send a huge thank you to Sports World, a local Eureka business, the Winship Leadership Team, and to the families and friends that donated to make these shirts available to everyone without a monetary impact. Go Vikings! The high school pottery sale is a local favorite and one that we look forward to attending in 2021. Here are some examples of previous student-made pottery. Thank you for listening to our report. We miss our normal visual and performing arts activities, but we will be back. Even in times when it seems like our season has been disrupted and seems unlikely to be celebrated, music and the arts are what can give us solace and hope. Please stay safe and healthy, and remember, the arts are essential.